while Matchbox goes to extraordinary lengths to match up all your relevant footage, there may come a time when you need to tweak the match list yourself. The first thing you should check out is the healing links, which show you that these two match ranges can be healed together, meaning that there has been no time inserted or deleted between them. It's up to you to take a look inside this gap and decide if it's fair to heal over, or if you'd rather leave this as a hole in your recon form. We see other potential healing options with these linking rods. These are matches which would be healable were it not for the changes in between. If we decide we're not interested in making this small change, we can delete it and heal over the resulting gap. This is a particularly useful approach for music or ambience creators who are less worried about small changes. We can also select all and heal everywhere that it's possible. This has the same effect as running a matchup with the healing preference set to aggressive. The top bar of the app features some of the more important editing tools. Starting from the left, we have Auto Sync Playheads, which slips the playheads around to try and find a better sync relationship based on the video image. For example, if you're looking to match a shot manually and you think you've found its counterpart, you can use this button to let Matchbox line it up precisely. So then we might want to use Create New Match at current positions. This does exactly what it says, creating a new match with a length of just one frame. Now we would have to manually find the match out point and capture it, which can be boring. So in most cases, you'll instead use force match, which creates a new match for you, fitted precisely to the length of the current clip or video shot. It even runs the automatic check for visible diffs if you have that feature enabled. Using this feature, we can very quickly match up a bunch of shots in a row, all manual, but really quite efficiently. Set in or out times to match the current playhead position. Note that it is possible to shift just one of the playheads and thereby create a match with incompatible durations. Matchbox will warn you and will highlight those matches in red, indicating that there's been some problem. Extend head and tail to fill a gap. This does just what it says, the only caveat being that it's possible to end up with overlaps in the old timeline, which translates to reusing that material when you run this reconform over your work.